प्लीज सब्सक्राइब लाइक एंड वॉच थैंक यू वेलकम बैक प्रॉब्लम सेवन पॉइंट हंड्रेड सो द स्टेटमेंट इज द मैक्सिम गेज प्रेशर इज नोन टू बी इलेवन हंड्रेड फिफ्टी पी एस आई इन स्पेरिकल स्टील प्रेशर वेसल हैविंग टेन इंच आउटर डायमीटर एंड जीरो पॉइंट टू फाइव इंच वॉल थिकनेस नोइंग दैट द अल्टीमेट स्ट्रेंथ स्ट्रेस इन द स्टील यूज इज सिगमा यू इज सिक्सटी के एस आई डिटरमाइंड फैक्टर ऑफ सेफ्टी विथ रिस्पेक्ट टू टेंसाइल फेलियर सो लेट स्टार्ट विद द गिवन डेटा इट इज गिवन दैट दिस इज स्पेरिकल प्रेशर वेसल एंड दैट इज मेड अबाउट स्टील क्लियर ऑल्सो प्रेशर इन दिस वेसल इज इलेवन हंड्रेड फिफ्टी पी एस आई सो पी इज इक्वल टू इलेवन हंड्रेड फिफ्टी पी एस आई क्लियर आउट साइड डायमीटर इज टेन इंच D naught is equal to ten inch, and thickness is zero point two five inch. Sigma ultimate is equal to sixty ksi, and this sixty ksi is equal to sixty into ten to the power three psi. Clear? What we have to find is we have to find the factor of safety factor of safety which is f o s for tensile failure so let's start with the solution as we know that uh, factor of safety is equal to sigma ultimate divided by sigma working or working stress so here we have here since it is spherical pressure vessel so we will have sigma 1 is equal to sigma 2 that will be equal to sigma working here which is not known yet and this sigma 1 is equal to sigma 2 which is equal to p into r divided by 2t now what is r so r is internal radius internal radius is equal to 1 over 2 outer diameter which will convert into outer radius minus thickness of the pressure vessel so 1 over 2 outer radius is 0.25 And uh, not ten inch. Outer radius is uh, one over two, and D naught is outer diameter is ten inch. So ten divided by two minus thickness, which is zero point two five inch. So from here you will get R is equal to four point seven five inch. Now you can put it. You have P, you have R, you have T. so you can find sigma 1 is equal to sigma 2 which is equal to p r divided by 2t so p is 1150 psi r is uh, 4.75 inch divided by 2 into thickness is 0.25 which will give you 10.925 p Into ten to the power three psi. Psi. There, or you can say that sigma one is equal to sigma two is equal to ten point nine two five ksi. Now you have sigma one and sigma two that is acting as. Uh, working stress clear so you can put it in formula factor of safety is equal to sigma ultimate divided by sigma working 
layer so sigma ultimate is equal to 60 ksi so 16 to 10 is to power 3 divided by working stress is 10.925 ksi so 10.925 ksi 10.925 10 is to power 3 again if you calculate it so you will get the vector of safety is equal to 5.49 so this is the answer now what does vector of safety means that under this stress under the stress of 10.925 this design is 5.49 times safer i hope you have enjoyed the video thank you for watching